Hello everyone. Happy Halloween. Welcome back to uh, Mystic Nights, which is a Korean only uh, PS2 exclusive that we never got uh, and has been fan translated, thankfully. Uh, I'm already digging the vibe, digging the music, know nothing about it, and very curious to find out what it is. Thanks everyone for joining me. Uh, let's get started. New game. This is another one where circle is yes. All right. Boy, oh boy. What is this creepy fish man? Excitement. I'd forgotten what it felt like. An emotion I haven't felt in five whole years. Excitement, all because of a single letter. Yeah, that was a very alien cover. This morning a letter came in the mail. On it, a name I'd hoped I'd never see again. Alan. Because of you, I... No, the past is in the past. The MSR, Alan, everything that happened. The more I try to run away... The more those damned memories come back to haunt me, even five years later. I still don't know who to blame. Was it all my fault? I'm loving this music. Alan invited me to service his advisor. He attached some kind of picture. A dead whale? What on earth? Monica? That name. The news about her captivated me most. Was my anger toward Alan in spite of her? Looks like I'll be seeing the both of them soon enough. Hmm. Mysterious. I wonder how she's doing. With the marriage and all. After reading that letter, I... I have to go see for myself. Yeah, I'm digging this already. All these thoughts are giving me a splitting headache. Lately, I've been watching a lot of Korean horror films. They do some good storytelling with horror. I was lost in thought, and before I knew it, there I was. The Military Institute of Strategic Research, a government-run organization tasked with highly classified research initiatives. I have a feeling this might have to do with aliens or deep ones. What is Monica doing there? The lab seemed ominous, and its size was daunting. But nothing else mattered. Nothing but Monica. Ridiculous, I know, but part of me wants to see her again. I wonder what kind of gameplay this is going to be. Is it a visual novel? Oh no, here we go. He's a handsome fella. What Korean horror movies would I recommend? Uh, I watched The Wailing, The... Oh, crap. I always forget what that movie is called. What was it? It was... Uh, the Wrath! That was it. The Wrath, The Wailing, Warning, Do Not Watch, and there was another one I saw. Um, Warning, Do Not Watch was my favorite. Uh, they're all on Shudder. I've been going through Shudder and just watching a bunch of shit. Um, apparently, uh, the, the Wrath is a remake of a film called Wailing Women that everybody thinks is much better, so I've added that to my list. Gotta watch that. Oh no, things have already gone horribly wrong! But yeah, I really, really liked Warning Do Not Watch. It's about a film student that wants to make the best horror movie ever, and she finds out that a horror movie was made by a ghost, and goes in search of it, and it's kind of about, like, the... <laughs> It's kind of about voyeurism and about why people watch horror and why people make horror, and it's really interesting. I really, really liked it. All right, how do, okay, that's how I move. This is some kind of item. I got a map. How do I, this is how I aim. Oh, my heart is beating in the corner, Well, that's fun. All right, all right. Oh, what's happening? Uh-oh. She doesn't look so good. Oh. Oh, 
delicious. Oh, well. Um, how do I... How do I shoot? Oh, that's how I shoot. Do you have some kind of tail? Is she... Oh, there's two things! There's two of them! Please die! Are you dead? Okay, that one's dead. I'm liking this monster design! Alright, what is... Give me item? Item? Pistol mag re acquired. Yay. Sorry, lady. I'm sorry about your death. You can interact with... Okay, interact with my door. There we go. Uh, oh, hi! Okay, the aiming is, um... It's something. I'm not, I'm not quite understanding aiming yet. Oh, there's another! Ouchies. I... Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no! Shit. Okay. Oh, fuck. How did I- how did I shoot? Oh no, I'm not- Okay, there we go, there we go. It's that button. Am I- am I hitting it? <laughs> no! What have I done? Okay, good. Whoa. Okay. Once you've, like, lifted your gun, you can't really change the angle of the gun, but you can change the angle of the camera, which is a l little weird. Like, I can turn the camera, I can't turn the gun. These things take a lot of bullets to die. Yay! Medkit! Alright, well, that was fun. I wasted a lot of bullets and I almost died. The monster designs are pretty nifty. Is there not a door here? So far, my only complaint is the camera issue there. That was, uh, that's gonna be weird to get used to. I'm used to games either not letting you move the camera or the weapon, or, you know, like, I don't know, it's just weird that I can, like, move my camera, but I couldn't move my gun. But now I have a sword, so I wanna use that. How do I sword? Can I not equip? I guess my sword's already equipped. How do I use it? Ah, there we go. Oh, and I can kick. Oh, yeah. I need more horror games that let me use a sword. I, it's not a katana. Because it's, I'm presuming most of the countries have different names for the swords and different ways of making them and stuff. But it looks like one just from, like, this cursory, pixelated, you know. It's definitely a, an eastern sword. I wonder what, it, I wonder what Korean style was. I know China has, like, the, Ch the Chinese traditional swords look really badass. I can't remember their name, but they're neat looking. And then, of course, Japan is the katana. The samurai sword. Alright. I got a sword. Let's go through this door. No? Uh, can't? Yeah. Uh... Hey, dead guy, do you have anything for me? No? Okay. Oh! <laughs> That's not translated. That's okay. Hmm. Nothing here. Can I go in? Is that a door? No. Must be a way to get in there. Hello? Is anyone home? Can I kneel? Can I get under things? Push to kneel. Okay, I don't think I can kneel. I don't think that's a power available to me. So I guess I can't do anything in here? I'm also digging, like, I know that this is a very traditional style of handsome in Eastern countries, but
But it's not grizzled white man. So even though it's a type of stereotypical, it's not the type I always... You know what I mean? I dig it. I love... I think he's very handsome and beautiful. And he has very wide shoulders. He has no ass, though. It's unfortunate for him, but he has none ass. It's really a shame. But I guess he has those broad shoulders. He's got something. But no junk in the trunk. Alright. So I can't open that door. Can't go in there. So I guess I need to go back this way and see if there was another something or other I missed. I went in there. Let's look at our handy... Okay, it's telling me I need to go around the corner? Oh. Oh, okay. So I'm supposed to find a key card for the door. What about this? So at least it's telling me that's where I need to go next. Maybe he's a top. <laughs> what? Tops can't have ass? <laughs> you gotta have something to grab. <laughs> uh, alright. Somebody, one of these corpses has gotta have a key. Come on. Bro, come on, bro. You got a key for me? No. Stupid. That's gonna be a shame, too. This game is probably too rare to have a guide or a walkthrough. Oh, no. We're just gonna have to get lucky. Or I guess watch somebody else's video on YouTube. That's a possibility. <sighs> Alright, time to go back into that other room, I think, and see if we can find a key. Hey, Akatsuki! Welcome to Mystic Knights, where I'm fighting some kind of hellish nightmare creature with a sword. Hey, Phantom Punk! Oh, shit! You guys came back? I killed you! See, the cam- the not being able to change angles when you started hitting is a little weird. Like, it, I don't know. It's, it's a little off. I wonder who made this game. Like, what specific team and if they've made other things. Oh, it's dead. I definitely prefer the sword. For sure, for sure. There we go. So they respawn pretty quick. Anything else in here? Anybody got a key? Wonder, did I pick up a note or something? Did I? Oh, X is no. Oh, I already looked at that. That's the note he got in the beginning. Oh! I have a key card, so maybe I just need to go back and use on door. Use key on door. Where did I get a key card? I have no idea. Okay. Time to use key. Yay. Hello, monsters. I'm loving this music. And these monsters are pretty creepy, but the way that these specific dog-looking ones don't seem to actually move their feet is kind of funny to me. They just kind of glide over, like, yum. <laughs> they are definitely very Silent Hilly. I wonder what year this came. I mean, it's PS2, so obviously it's at least after 1 and 2, probably. Yeah, at least 1. Ooh. I am curious when this came out. Because those look a lot like the Silent Hill 4 dogs. I wonder if this came out before or after that. All right, gotta turn on the power. Hmm. That's intriguing. Okay. So neither of those doors are working yet. That's where I came in down there, right? Yeah. Those aren't doors. So... I'm there. Power room is that way? So wait, am I- what door is this? Let's look at our map. Okay, so I need to turn around. I think. Because it's glowing in the other area. Does that mean that's where the power room is? What's this? Aha! It is a room! Hmm. Have I played Rule of Rose? I have! I have not finished it! I played, like, the first two hours, 
but I now have access to it again, so we will play it again at some point. I enjoyed what I played of it. I got stuck on a boss real bad. Alright, we got power! Oh, how do I save in this game? It's occurred to me that that's going to be a problem that we're going to have to face. Oh boy. Oh no. Oh golly. Alright, I guess I'm just going to go back out here. Oh, I hear... Yeah, I thought so. Hey, how you doing? Oh, level one. I'm, I, I guess weapons, like, level up in this game? Ow, ow. Stop tonguing me! Oh, nope, you got a friend. No, <laughs> fuck off! Oh, it actually now looks like a person bent over backward. I didn't catch that first time around. That is definitely a human head upside down. Well, that's fun. Okay, I'm gonna go this way to that door that was locked. Yeah, this camera. Some games should have fixed cameras. Yeah, PS2 horror games tend to be really expensive because they didn't print that many of them, so now they're hard to find. Which is why, uh, yo ho ho, in a bottle of rum, I've become a pirate. <laughs> Uh, also, I mean, you just you can't buy this in America. It's a Korean game and it never went anywhere else. I wonder if it did well in Korea. And just they weren't, you know, translating, sending stuff out. Not as big an audience yet. I don't know. Hello? Oh, is this the girl? The soft music is playing. It's probably my girl. Ooh, this soundtrack's so pretty. Uh-oh. Are we not gonna get subtitles for these? Translator! Translator! Oh no. Okay, good. It's very short. I could have sworn it was her. Okay, so it's not Monica. I've not played Manhunt. Uh, it's on my list. Oh, now we got some visual novel shit. I think so. The name is Bruce McKellen, but feel free to call me Bruce. I'm Jennifer. I have very big boobs and they have valves on them, so you can open them up and pump them up. How did you end up in this hellhole? I don't remember. I probably have a mysterious and tragic backstory. Man, his shoulders are very broad. And so is his chin. Get some rest and gather your thoughts. Alright. Really, what are those things for? It looks like she's an air mattress! The explosion damaged the power grid. We've gotta find a way out. It's not safe here. I'll take a look. You stay here. Don't let them see you. Yeah, there are a lot of Jennifers in horror games. We'll talk later. Please trust me. Will you wait for me here? Please be careful. I wonder what she's doing here. The accident must have affected her memory. Eh, he's not the blandest pretty boy. We've seen a lot blander in most American shooters. This guy is a little more, uh, like, if you put him in a lineup with 12 guys from, you know, grizzled video games, yeah, I'd, I'd pick out Bruce. I'd pick him out. And it's not just because he is literally my type of human male. <laughs> he also definitely looks more unique than a million male shepherds. I don't know if y'all saw on Twitter the other day, it was going around this just, somebody had just cropped off all the faces of a bunch of, like, male leads from Western games. The only one I could pick out was Male Shepherd. <laughs> all the other ones looked exactly like. <laughs> oh, man. Alright. Time for me and my cargo pants to save the day! There we go. 
There. Oh no, I am not doing so hot. How do I? There we go. Oh, hi! How you doing? Oh man, that, that effect on her head twitching. Nice! That was good. Oh, you're right! He does look like the character from Evil Within. They do kind of look similar. They both have very dark color palettes and very dark hair. Broad shoulders. The Evil Within guy definitely looks a little more unique than most. Uh, I don't. I don't remember him being very grizzled. If I, 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 can, I can't remember what he looks like. I know he was a pretty tall, pale-skinned, dark-haired guy. That's all I remember. All right, I have another key card, don't I? Key card time. Key card time. All right. Hello, you are uh, slightly different. Mm, you're the same kind of weird dog creature, but blue. Are you... St okay, you're still kicking. And it's dead. I should take a look around, explore the lab. So, oh boy. I bet you nothing horrible is waiting for me in the labs. Hmm. It's really unfortunate that he decided to visit this one specific day. If he'd only waited till next Tuesday. Hey, lady. How you doing? I love the head twitching thing. They've done that very well. Yeah, that, that, oh man, that's nice. It's almost like a static effect a little bit. These Silent Hill nurses look better than the Silent Hill nurses. I like them. Okay, she's dead. Bye, Aaron. Thanks for joining us. Have a good one and a happy Halloween. Oh, hello, nurse. Where'd you go? I also like that they all wear go-go boots. You can dance, you can die, having the time of your life. You're the murder queen. All right, more keys. Oh, welcome back, Cygnus. Ah, I heard a terrifying scream coming from the lower floors. Am I going crazy? I still can't get that scream out of my head. Oops, I keep pushing X when the button is circle. Peter seemed surprised. It was clearly the sound of someone in pain. The screams have stopped. What is going on down there? Tomorrow is my last day. I need to find out what's happening. Uh, no, if it's your last day, you need to leave. You've decided to put in your, uh, uh, resignation immediately. You need to go. Hey, Wasp, thanks for joining us. Happy Halloween. That is an ominous looking machine. Oh. Across the hall. Where it is? What? What is this? Oh, I got a strong vest. Okay, I guess it's just equipped to me now. Cool. And what is this? Oh my god, am I about to, like, teleport over? Oh no, it's a save point! Yay! Save point! Alright. Alright. We'll keep going for a little while. Do at least like an hour, hour and a half of each game we try. After this, I think we're gonna try another uh, exclusive that never got translated called Mizerna Falls. I don't know that it's as horror, uh, um, as mainline horror as this. It, like, this is obviously a survival horror game. I think it's more of a exploration game with like creepy elements, but it's been compared to Twin Peaks, so I gotta try it. I wonder uh, how much uh, differently this game plays if you don't play on easy. Because <laughs> all the monsters just kind of stand there and let me hit them. <laughs> They're just like, yeah, we know you're playing on easy. Just just go for it. Just take us. It's fine. Alright, I turned on the power. 
Good night, Brad. Thanks for joining us. Hopefully your work night's not too rough. See you later. Anything? Anything else? Nope. All right. Let's go, handsome man! You can dance, you can dance. That song's gonna be stuck in my head now. Hey, Gabriel, welcome. Am I supposed to go back into that room? Is that what it wants? It looks like it's, it's shining. All right. Oh, I can leave the map on and still run around. That's fun. Oh, hello again. Oh, she's got some kind of like brainstem thing. There is definitely some kind of alien or deep sea creature thing going on here. Definitely. So I turned on the power. Did it want me to do something in here? Why was it? Okay, I guess we didn't have to do anything in here. Let's go. That that very uh, alien-esque cover screen makes me think this might be some kind of alien thing. But it also kind of looks like a fish. Which is making me think maybe it's some kind of creatures from the deep thing. Guess I'm gonna go down this way first. Mm -hmm. No, I can't go in there? What's this? Oh, it's this way. I keep mistaking warning signs for doors. <laughs> yeah, I'm very curious as to what the creatures are and why they are uh, around. Not dressing up? Nah, I decided. I just... I did not answer in the door for anybody, because, you know, situation over here at all, and I'm too tired anyway, so... Nothing this year, unfortunately. It'll be the first year in, uh, like, five or six that I haven't dressed up as a Silent Hill character. <laughs> oh, well. Always next year. Alright, I think she's dead. <laughs> Delvin. <laughs> Alright. Gimme. I've had four cups of coffee. Why am I yawning? Goodness. I found the materials you asked for. I left the liquid alloy in the bag in your lab and the cell tissue in the freezer in Sector C. This combination is highly corrosive. Don't go using this on metal. It'll explode. Walter, what are you up to? Solution. Sample A, B, C, D, H, Okay, so we're definitely going to have to use that to melt something, aren't we? Bye, Lonely Menace. Thanks for joining us. All right, I got a sample. Hmm. Can't interact with anything? Okay. Can't go in there. Nano cell laboratory. I wonder if the translator actually translated that. Or if it was already just that. I would assume that they translated it. But I, I don't know if you can do that. If I understand correctly, the way that translators tr fan translate games is by going in and altering text files. But you wouldn't be able to do that with images unless you recreated the image? I don't know. I really don't know how, how it works. That's curious. All right, we're going to try going down that hallway. Oh, Lord, I'm tempted to have another cup of coffee. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, hello. Hello, lady. Why are you so breathy? Mm -hmm. Are you tired? Go lay down. Take a nap. I'll be here to be murdered later. Really, it's fine. Take a break. Was that somebody? Yep. So far, it seems like all the men turned into uh, horrible uh, nightstands with tongues. And the women seem to be turned into hell nurses. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Oh, hello. Alright. 
anything in here? No. Okay, it's the room next door. That's why. Oh, hello. The quiet and the lack of warning about the monsters is pretty neat. They aren't that aggressive, but I'm playing on easy, which is probably why. Oh, this one's blue! So there seems to be, like, variants of the uh, monsters based on color. Maybe that's, like, how long it's taken, like, how long they've been transformed or something? Hmm. Oh, I got an alloy! All right. Are those his only attacks? He has a gun, but I was wasting a lot of bullets on every single creature we came across. And also, sword is cooler. So I am swordsman now. Uh, am I? There we go. Ow. Sir. Come on, get it, get it, get it. I got it. One sec. Come on, there it goes. Uh, do, 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 do. Okay. Uh, oh! Another dead body! A dead scientist. We got sample in a diary. I've stumbled upon some incredible data from the underground lab. They are experimenting with cells that regenerate and multiply indefinitely. They think they found the key to immortality. I bet they didn't. Some of the data was damaged, so I don't know the details. The liquid and tissue I requested from Gray can confirm if these experiments are real. How on earth did they manage to engineer these cells? Introducing them into the human body may have adverse effects on our DNA. I bet they did! Something changed after the explosion. I wish I could get samples from these corpses and run tests. You know what you've collected can be... Okay. So yeah, they found something and they did some meddling with it and they put it in humans and it did not go so well for them. It seems. What is this game? It is a Korean exclusive for the PS2 called Mystic Knights. And so far it's got like elements of a visual novel-ish, mostly in just like story presentation, and then like survival horror aspects and a little bit of like Resident Evil style gameplay here. It's neat. I'm digging it. Okay. Let's see. Looks like the map wants me to go this way. Oh, hello, blue guy. I'm not dealing with you. I want to find the plot. Where am I going? Okay. Do, 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 do. I'm digging the music. Very atmospheric and, uh, sci-fi-y spacey I'm getting some alien vibes from this I don't know if it's actually going to end up be aliens but they definitely took some aesthetic inspiration from aliens for sure Bob where are you going bye Bob bye nurse goodbye alright I'll kill you you're in my way. Be gone from me. Okay, it almost sounds like it's purring. <laughs> I wondered if it was gonna stand there forever. It's like, nah, I'll come get you. Alright, it's dead. Gonna go up and then over. 
Alrighty. Excuse me, guys. Do, 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 do. So it wants me to go back to the start over here? Oh, I'm gonna use the uh, combination of the uh, materials to explode open the front door, is what it seems like. Okay. I guess I need to maybe figure out a way to fuse them? Oh no, I'm at the wrong spot, that's why. He's gonna blow something else up, I guess. Maybe. <laughs> Just kick the door. Uh. All right. So I guess we're gonna use the material in here somewhere. I might still be missing something. Maybe it's that's it. Maybe it's over here. Oh no! It came from the deep. They found something in the deep. Last February, the mutilated remains of a 30M white bearded whale were discovered by the Greenpeace organization. The inexplicable size of the lacerations is alarming scientists. Some believe an ancient aquatic creature measuring in at 10 to 20M larger than the whale may have made its way to higher sea levels due to changes in seawater temperature. Of course, no such creature has been found to exist. This mysterious case has since been deemed a freakish accident. Is that the same picture Alan sent me? So a whale was murdered by something and it was giant scratches on it that got it murdered and everybody freaked out because oh no, giant sea creature murdering whales, holy shit. I'm gonna guess they found giant sea creature and decided to experiment on it because nothing can possibly go wrong. I'm really digging this. I wanna know what's going on. What happened to the whale? Did you create whale monsters? Oh, my blade is now level two. <laughs> it leveled up and I didn't even notice. Oh, Jesus! You leveled up too! You look different! Oh, you're a different thing. Oh, neat! I am digging these creatures! What even are you? You look like you could be in, like, Doom or something. That is cool. Very alien. That head shape and every- Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Woo! Meters! Ah! That's what the M is for. I've never seen M as a shorthand for measurement, so I was like, I don't know. <laughs> it's meters. That makes sense. We don't do that here. We 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 have to have our own little special American thing, and be different from everyone. It's how we feel. It's how we feel things. Ooh, save point. All right. Do do do. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's another vest protection thingy. Alright, I don't think there's anything else in here. Hey guys, how is it going? Ow. Sir, would you give me a moment to prepare my sword? All right, got you. Of course, Akatsuki. That's exactly what I meant by different. That's how my people do. 
We must adhere to the old, stupid, and flawed ways. Bob, come say hi. Oh, hello. The monsters are very silent hilly in that they just kind of chill around and, you know, kind of stumble after you a little. And they're all horrible to look at. Hi! Y'all can't see Bob. He just got right in my face and cried. Come back! Come here! Come here! Come here! Baby boy! What did you want? You wanted my attention! Come here, baby boy! Come on! Say hi! Come here. Can you say hi? Ow. You're so shy, Bob. Why are you so shy? And now you're going away again. Bye, Bob. Such a shy baby. <sighs> Sell tissue. Okay, now I have all the stuff I need for the explosive. I think. Okay, so I need to go back. Here, I'm just gonna keep this way and then to the- Whoa, well, hello. You guys respawn pretty quick. <laughs> Good thing Bob doesn't know how many people can see him or he can hide. He, he's a, a fan of hiding from people. If he knows them, he's fine with them. When I- my old roommates- Brad, who was here earlier, and uh, my cousin Johanna, he became very friendly with them. He's friendly with my mom, but he has to have known these people for literally years before he's comfortable enough to like come out and say hi, because he's he is very, very shy, and he doesn't want to exist in any room that I'm not in. He is incredibly attached. Is that how I operate it? Okay, is this the thing I need to use the items on? Aha! Oh, shit. Okay, actually, that note had... Memo for Walter. A sample plus B sample plus cell tissue plus liquid alloy. I don't know if the order matters, but if so, I already fucked up. Okay, let's see. I've made an explosive! Or a corrosive. I've made something destructive. As was my goal all along. And I printed something. Is this reactor related to those monsters? What the hell were they trying to accomplish? Strange liquid acquired. Experiment report required. Analyzing data. Increased levels of telomerase, rate of cell division increased by a factor of 23. Danger! Rapid cellular decay detected. Ah, well that's fun. Some kind of cell research. Okay, so I need to go back out. I love that the map tells you exactly where you need to go. Every video game should, by law, be required to adapt a system similar to Dead Space, in which you push a button and it just shows a light that shows you what direction you should run in. <laughs> or they could be like Black Desert Online, which literally has a button that you push that just makes your character run in the direction of the next, next quest marker. <laughs> and he just runs right to where you're supposed to be. <laughs> oh, this isn't where I'm supposed to be. That game, that is a bonkers invention for video games. It's amazing. Someone... Okay. Time for explosive! Just gonna rub this. Just rub it on there and I'm fine, obviously. The tissue sample's releasing huge amounts of energy. What is it from? Is this man a scientist? What are your credentials, sir? 
Oh, you're new. You kind of look like a weird version of Scyther. But fucked up. Owie. Ow, ow, ow. I'm gonna just, you know. Ow. What? Oh, come on. My health wasn't even that low. What was that game? Okay. Game over. Thought I was going to play Dead Space 2 at some point. I definitely am. It's one of the ones I've been trying to get a hold of. And I just haven't had the time to go out and get it. Uh, but uh, we will definitely play it. I'm, I'm kind of trying to work through what I already have as well. And I don't have Dead Space 2 yet. At least I don't have it in a way to easy stream it. Because my PC can't handle it. Okay. I want to keep playing this one for a little bit. Because I am digging it. Good thing we just saved pretty recently, I think. I think we just need to make the explosive again. So clearly I am not good at telling how damaged I am in this game. Let's see what my... Sample liquid alloy. I'm missing something. I must be further back than I thought, damn it. Okay. Oh, no, I'm not, because I find it in the next room. Okay. Yeah, the menu looks exactly like it's from Alien. There's a very, uh, uh, Geiger-esque influence here, for sure. Here, let's... Hello. Yeah, I have a hard time telling, like, what is damage. Because the heart's red all the time. Is it it becoming... I don't know. I'm gonna have to pay attention. Is it the heartbeats? I don't know, because my heart was still beating and still red and I just died. Oh, well. Like, yeah, I can't tell that I'm taking damage. I do know... The vest seems to be, like, a layer of defense that wears off with time. Are you dead? Okay. I'm also getting a very, uh, alien vibe with the music. Like, uh, it's very alien-inspired, I feel like, for sure. And there's definitely some aspects of Resident Evil and Silent Hill going on. But that's inevitable in this genre. Bye-bye. Alright. There we go. That's the thing we needed. So now we can go fuse it. It was what room? It was across the way. Excuse me, sir. I've got shit to do. Explosives to make. Now I'm going to save again. <laughs> because why not? Just in case. Hello. Alright. Mm, A sample. B sample. Cell tissue. And... Alloy. Ta-da! Alright. Back we go. And this time, I will just run from the orgy of monsters. Okay, which door was I going for? This one. I 
just looks so funny. Like, I know they're trying to say he's, like, pouring it out, but it looks like he's just rubbing the vial on the door. <laughs> oh, boy. All right. Monsters? Monsters. Excuse me, monsters. I got places to be. Oh, I have to handle the monsters first? Really? That wasn't a requirement earlier. All right, get in a line and wait for me to murder you. Ah, uh, I might want to heal just in case. All right, two down. Come on, new guy. Scyther wannabe. Hey, Lonely. Welcome. Okay. Oh, nope. You're still here. Hello. You guys are pretty tough. Oh, and you can dodge pretty well. Seriously? Seriously? Oh, and the item faded away. Die already, bitch. Yay. A lot of time passed while I was unconscious. I wonder what happened. It seems to be safe now. I have to get Jennifer. So I guess he's going to go back and bring her to this place? Because he was just clearing the way or something? I guess. So they were trying to clear the way to the control room, it seems like? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hey, Faku! Uh, I am Sergeant Jane Blair. This is Dr. John Nielsen. I'm Bruce. This is Jennifer. I thought we were the only survivors. It's good to see new faces. What the hell is going on? There was a big explosion, then everyone just vanished. All gone without a trace, then monsters started roaming around. Sorry, that's all I know. Entrance was blocked, so I couldn't get out. Why do you have dots on your nipples? You can use the VIP elevator in the first floor basement. Bobby, what are you doing? I can't guarantee the elevator is functional. The explosion may have triggered our emergency quarantine mode and locked all exits. Happy Halloween! <laughs> There's an escalator to transport supplies. Let's hurry. Take us to the elevator. There's one problem. It's a short distance to the elevator, but we don't have enough weapons. We don't know what kind of monsters are out there. Don't worry, lady. I think you and your nipples can handle them. I'm amazed you managed to get here in one piece. It's okay. I have a sword. Hard to believe. The only place we could find that wasn't crawling with monsters. Stay out there a few minutes and they'll swarm you like bees. But we can't stay here forever. Everyone in this game has pretty great titties. It's dangerous to go alone. I'll come with you. Ah, it's Navi. Let me take a look first. I'll evaluate whether it's safe and come get you. Okay, but isn't she like a soldier and you're like a... I don't know, actually. Because it never really clarified other than he was friends with somebody that worked here and got summoned back here. And apparently he maybe used to work with them or something. They never really qualified, like, what he is. So maybe he is qualified to fight. I mean, he's definitely kicking butt with this sword. 
Yeah, I really have no idea what his job is. What are your qualifications, sir? And lady, why are you wearing an incredibly weird uh, anime vest that has no purpose? Like, why would you wear that? It can't keep you warm. It can just kind of wrap gently around your titties. I mean, it's not the worst thing ever, but it definitely looks weird. I really don't like things like that that accentuate the titties individually that way. It's not comfortable. It looks weird. If you're going to do it, do it like a shelf. One individual titty. That's just my theory of titty art design. <laughs> it always looks less weird. Hmm. Alright, what do we got? More horrible nightmares? Anybody? Horrible nightmares? Locked. Damn it. I don't think I have... Yeah, I don't got anything. Hmm. It's locked. And it looks like this door might be just dead. Oh no, it opens. Oh. Well. Uh-oh. Well, this place uh, seems to have suffered some damage. I got a card! Yay! Oh, hello. No, 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 no. Let me. Alright, these guys are pretty easy, but uh, get them in a group and they are kind of annoying. They drop a lot of items, though. Thank you, safe mode. Easy mode, not safe mode. What am I talking about? Should bring everyone here. Okay. All right. It's really sad that these are kind of dumb outfits for boobs, and yet they're not even the worst thing video Maybe games have ever come out with. Sense. They're actually pretty yeah, decent, comparatively. All right, we gotta go to the generator room and solve power problems. Emergency power is running low. We need to hurry! I need to get out of this place. I can't die here. No one cares, sir. Calm down. Nobody's dying. I like that everybody's incredibly built. Even the scientist guy. Hey, Blue Wayfarer, welcome. Alright, so I'm heading back out, I guess. Y'all chill and just let me do all the work. Power room, here I come. We're not gonna stream with someone else tonight? Yeah, uh, it was supposed to be around 8, but they were busy doing their uh, Animal Crossing. They had a bunch of streams planned and the PT one had not come up and I hadn't heard from them, so I went ahead and started it up. Uh, I have since heard from them, and they were already in the middle of it, and I was already in the middle of this, and I was like, alright, it just, it kind of didn't work out. But they're a really great channel. I've worked with them a couple times. I was on their podcast once, uh, Just Add Monsters on YouTube and Twitch. Really fun group of people over there. Jordan makes a lot of really cool videos, and they recently did a, uh, uh, interview with the creators of Condemned, and did some cool research on how the game was made. Condemned 2, I think, maybe? It was really neat. So yeah, look up Just Add Monsters on YouTube and Twitch. I don't have a map of this floor. Damn it. The map was making everything so easy. Are there any other doors over here? Hmm. So this door goes 
into this hallway. Go. And that door goes into this messed up area. And then there's the two doors. Oh, excuse me. Mm. So it seems like my health is the color of the heart, and the brighter red it is, the healthier I am. I was trying to see if maybe the color of red was draining out, and like when it was gray I was dead, but it's not the whole icon, it's just the heart. That's what was confusing me. Okay, so yeah, I can't do... Goodness, why am I tired? I can't do anything else in this area, so I must need to backtrack to a power room. Okay. Back we go. Yeah, those creatures are on wheels. <laughs> it's pretty great. I like those guys. <laughs> okay. So, I guess we're gonna go back this way, or maybe we need to go upstairs. Let's see if this door opens. Mm, no, it's not working. Alright, let's go up the stairs? No? Can't- I can't walk upstairs? I am incapable of stairs, apparently! I apparently can't stairs. Can I go up this ramp? No. Okay. Oh, this game has just been translated? I didn't realize it was that recent. Alright, yep. Cannot open this door. Cannot go down the stairs or up the stairs. So where's the power? I guess it's gotta be on this side somewhere. That was a dead end. Maybe there's another door out of the main room? Excuse me. Nothing to see here. Alright. Aha! I see a door! Hey, Shogo! I'm so glad you like the channel! Thanks for joining us! Happy Halloween! <gasps> we have a map! Hallelujah, we have a map! Alright. We're in the right room, so... Power? Turn on power? Power's back on! Hell yeah! Do I plan to play it till the end? Oh yeah, we'll definitely finish this game at some point. I am definitely loving it. There's very few games that we play that, like... I will not play them, you know, can, I will not finish them. Like, I don't know that I'll ever be able to beat the original Siren all the way through, because it's very difficult. But, uh, you know. For the most part, I want to play things through to the end. Well, unfortunate for him. Survivors! It seems like they were being chased. It does seem like it. Oh, hello. Oh no, don't worry, Delvin. We had a map to a different floor. We just didn't have a map to this section of the building. Just found that one. Uh, hello. Oh no. Excuse me. It is already almost midnight. I can't believe it. Ah. 
All right. Oh. Bruce! Jean? Uh-oh. Jean? What's happening, Jean? She's probably about to die. Okay, I'm going... There we go. Oh, no. Oh, no. Well, that's unfortunate. I like how they walk. It's very creepy. Oh, she's alive! Is this like a, a rescue mission? Like, if I kill these things fast enough, she might live. Oh, this game gives you a Megami Tensei vibe? You know, I kind of get it. Those games are very futuristic and monstery, and they kind of have a visual novel aspect to them a lot of the time. Oh, well. Uh, um. What do we do, Jane? She doesn't have much time. We need the new ESA lab we developed. Okay. What does that mean? There's a cold room at the end of the hall. It has some ESA. Okay. I'm supposed to go get an item to help her out. Where's... I do love that this map just stays open to help me out. So, I can't go through this way. I'm gonna have to go the long way around. Well, I hope this lady can hang on until then. Uh, gonna be unfortunate. If not. Oh, and my health needs, um, fixed, I think. Ow. This guy is, uh... Oh, no. No, 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 no. I have done too much shit to die. I will save first. Fuck you guys. I'm out of here. Come on. Okay. So, I don't know if I can... How am I supposed to get back to that? Oh, no! I see. There's a cut through in one of the rooms. I need to go back this way. Uh, thank you, handy dandy map. So I don't think I can go back up that elevator. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Coming through. Don't mind me just passing on through. On my way to save a lady that got stabbed in the torso. Ooh. This is a fancy room. Alright, end of the hall. Oh no! Hello, excuse me. I say excuse me! report. The tissues we removed from the test subject show highly regenerative properties. At rest, the cells seem rabble normal. However, with a bit of stimulation, they begin to divide at an exorbitant rate. Superhuman soldiers that cannot die. We're on the cusp of greatness. A word of caution. Do not allow the tissue and stimulant to come in contact with liquid metal. The result would be an explosion. As the explosion is proportional to the amount of solute, this reaction cannot be used for military purposes with our current technology. Further research is currently underway. Did I say I might do a clock tower? Uh, at some point, yeah. I don't know if, uh, I might just continue playing this game for a little while longer and then call it a night, because it's way later than I thought it was. And I'm digging this game anyway. We've discovered a new metal born from an unknown energy source. Remarkable. A new source, eh? There's much going on here. Quite mysterious. Get the thing. P 
Peter's been acting strange. I spent the entire day searching for him yesterday, but I couldn't find him. I saw him this morning. He looked like a mess. Now he's gone and disappeared again. He won't even speak to me. I thought we were close. Peter hasn't even left his room today. I can hear his muffled screams from outside his door. He must be in pain. Come to think of it, he's been sweating a lot lately. What's happening to him? Peter finally left his room today. However, the Peter I knew was gone. What stood in front of me was an empty shell. Hmm. Oh, no. There's so many. Okay. Oh, what was the purple shit? All right. Bye, surfing. Thanks for joining us. Have a good one. My health was getting low again. These guys are pretty obnoxious. They can do a lot of damage. Got a stimulant. Let's run back to cop fighter lady and see if we can save her. Oh, you're a new thing. What are you? Do you spew something? Was that what that purple dust was earlier? Well, that's fun. Oh, hello. Okay. save our friend hopefully unless we're too late <laughs> oh my god really if she dies we're as good as dead nobody knows the way as well as she does Hey, Ethan! Happy Halloween! Get some rest. I want to see him injured with his, like, titties cut and half-open shirt, man. Hey, Nacho! I got Jane's ID card and maps. Nice. Thanks. I hope you and your titties recover. Your shirt was not that cut open! Oh my god. <laughs> god. Itties are always the weak point, it seems. Oh my god. Oh no, the wound is fatal. They've cut her titties! Oh. If she doesn't get treatment, she may die in mere moments! Everyone knows that's where the internal organs are stored. In the titty. Excuse me. Hello. Hello, monster. Meet my blade! Oh, I need healing. Come on. Come on. Are you dead? Alright. 
If this is just a room with a monster, then I don't need it. Let's see. It wants me to go this way? Need a card. Uh, do I have one? Yeah. Ooh, ominous dark hallway. My favorite kind of hallway. Larva laboratory. Don't like the sound of that. I don't think there should be a laboratory for that. I don't trust these people with it. Not after what I've seen today. Turned on some power. It's a giant radio player! <laughs> I love it. The design of this game and the, like, the art and stuff is very good, very fun. All right. Where are we going now? This way? Where do we go now? Oh, hello. Let's move further away from that guy. Oh, well, that's a new color. A new variant. Seriously, this one is tough. He refuses to die. There we go. Yay. Alright. Data stick. Password login. Update error. Okay. Hello. I'm just gonna run on through. Way too many of you. Due to the explosion, we are unable to access the central lobby hall. The vehicle hangar in Sector C is the only way through. The red and white squadrons are evacuating survivors while the blue squadron restores control to the tower. Afterwards, we're burning the hangar to the ground. Hmm. So this has probably been going on for a little while. Okay, so that notes a clue to the password? Password log on. Uh, uh, 3-3-3-1-1? Okay. Okay, then what was the other one? Four, two, three, five, six. Four, two, three, five, six. Ta da! Although Project Ancient was deemed a success, the body of an average human is 99% likely to reject the transplant. Clones are the answer. With just a strand of DNA, we can create a perfect clone that is guaranteed to be a 1% outlier. Clones show no sign of rejection post-transplant. What do you want to bet Jenny is? Hey, Jenny is an alien clone of a human. Woo! We've solved the mystery. Oh, that poor man. He's been melted! Aw, oh, thank you, Ethan! Nightmare Creatures is another game I have. Uh, oh, that's the guy we saw dragged off. I almost picked it for today, but I decided I really wanted to try some of the stuff that I really just knew nothing about. Like this one. Okay. Where did that explosion come from? Seems like there's been a big accident. Man, that got me good. No chance to even shoot my gun. 
Those monsters. I'm going to die, won't I? Aw, oh, hi, Silent Konami. Thanks for chiming in and saying hey. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm dying! Oh shit! Shit, get in, get in! Oh shit! What the fuck? <laughs> it's a motorcycle monster! And there's two of them! Oh, I'm boned. Oh my god! What the hell? <laughs> that was amazing! Oh my god. I don't even know how I'm gonna try and kill these. This is just gonna take forever. Oh, so what happened on Twitch? Most likely, given what uh, appears to have happened, Somebody reported me, and since I am technically streaming movies, and you're not technically supposed to do that, even though a lot of people do, uh, I got a copyright ban, which is a temporary suspension. So, I don't know how long temporary is. It's one day to a month. Uh, so eventually the channel will come back. I think what happened is I have a lot of haters on YouTube, and I don't normally post on my YouTube channel when we're gonna chill out and do chill stuff elsewhere. And so one of the haters must have seen that update and said, oh, hey, a good chance to run amok and cause trouble, and reported the stream. Uh, so in the future, I just won't do that anymore. You'll have to be on the Discord to know that we're gonna hang out and watch stuff. Which, like, seriously, come on. You're gonna ban me for watching, like, one of my own DVDs with friends because it's on Twitch? The only other option is Discord, which is slow and laggy as shit. This is taking forever. <sighs> there used to be a thing called Rabbit that was really useful, and unfortunately, Rabbit is dead. And this thing 2-7 doesn't seem to be a very convenient alternative. You have to create an account, and the the connect the contact. Eh, it doesn't. It is doesn't work. Listen, I'll obey the law when the billionaires start obeying the law. Until then, they don't need my three dollars to rent films and shit. They can fuck off. Alright, these guys are not dying. I think I'm just gonna have to risk it. Oh, they aim at me! Fuck! I was gonna try and get around them. Those- those are my favorite monsters so far! Holy shit! That is awesome! I'll use the same liquid as before. Do I have it? So, I need to go create more explosives. Cause I'm gonna have to get past these idiots again. Fuck. Unless I can. Owie. Ow. And the thing is, they're gonna respawn probably, cause these things. These monsters respawn real fast. And I've used all my health! Fuck! Oh man, we might be doomed now. This may be a sign that this might need to be the end of the stream, because I don't- there's no way I'm gonna survive this! Nope, 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 nope. Serpentine, serpentine! Yeah, I'm dead. Those things are badass! They look like something out of DMC, for real. Man. That was cool. We will play more of this soon. Um, I'm gonna take a couple days off, at least two days probably. Uh, finish up some things. Take a little breather after October. I hope everybody enjoyed uh, Halloween and October and the stuff we've been doing. We didn't get everything I wanted to do done just because a lot of stuff has been going on this month. Uh, a lot of things going on, changes and such, but... Uh, I had fun with it. And obviously we're not going to stop playing horror, hello. But, uh, we will maybe change tracks for a little bit. Play some RPGs and stuff. Uh, I'm going to work on fixing the freaking capture card and figuring out what was going on. Um, thanks for watching. If you like what I do and want to support it, consider becoming a member of the channel for as little as 99 cents a month to get access to bonus content, which we'll uh, be picking up again next month. I'll actually be making specific videos for members once again. Uh, the book 
is gonna be finished this weekend. I'm gonna take the next two days, put my final rep on it, and just stop editing it! Um, and then people that have already pre-ordered it, I'll send out the digitals to everybody, uh, and post about it online and everything. All that. Um, I think that's everything as far as news and stuff. Uh, I'll post a new schedule to the Discord once I figure out what the plan is for next month and what I'm gonna do. Uh, yeah. And thanks again for watching. I hope you had a good Halloween and enjoyed, uh, some of the games we tried here. Some some stranger things haha -ha. um yeah thanks again to all our members uh delvin jeff who else was here today ethan a uh who else uh i think that's who's here right now thanks again for supporting the channel and for hanging out with us today i hope y'all enjoyed it and i'll see y'all uh, let's see if today's Saturday. We'll say Tuesday at the earliest. Uh, I'll probably be done by Tuesday. So I'll see y'all then. Bye. Thank you.